so hello everyone welcome to your pdf platform so my today video is related to uh, one of the maharatna public sector that is the gale india limited uh, the recruitment is for the senior manager uh, senior engineer for various branches uh, some other domains are also there so i'm going to cover that roughly 250 plus vacancies are there and this video uh, my, my this video is going to cover two components first one is i'm going to cover about the recruitment process for each and everything for each and every domain what is the uh, this experience required what is the education qualification required what is the age criteria what is the selection process i'm going to cover to that in the second part i am to going to cover about how you have to prepare for the group discussion and the interview so watch my this video accordingly if you want to know about the recruitment then the first component about the second component about the second part that will be related to your this preparation for the group discussion and the interview because ye jo aapka job hai senior engineer ka that is for the experience post experience post ke liye so when we are going for any job which is related to the experience so uske requirements thode sa different hoti hai so i am going to cover that so that but that will be in the second part so first of all let us cover about the recruitment so this is the gain it is opportunity for various discipline in the grade of e1 and e2 even e2 ke liye maharatna public sector hai uh, for senior manager for renewable it is the six vacancies for senior manager boil operation 3 for mechanical it is 30 for electrical it is 6 so you can go through that for chemical it is 36 and then uh, for senior engineer in geltel again five sometime geltel ka jo recruitment hai wo uh, separate aata hai lekin is bar isme inhone combine kar diya so fire and safety again 20 because this we deals with the Uh, this oil sector uh, natural gas so fire safety is very important uh, aspect for these organizations like ioc lhpc hai bahut bada role hai for fire and safety it is 20 for cnp uh, this is 22 then for civil it is 11 for marketing it is 22 marketing again oil sector so many competitors are there in terms of public sector government and then this uh, private so marketing is also very one of the very important domain for any organization so 22 then finance and accounts then 36 human resource 23 law 22 so i am going to cover in the second stage where i going to cover about the gdn interview main usme sare expect cover karke chalenge hum log har har factor ko it is not only related to the domain specific it is not like that i am going to cover only the engineering part i am going to cover all the components especially when we talk about how to prepare for the interview for senior officer for this corporate communication laboratory security official language these respective vacancies are there so total 261 vacancies are there so out of these some uh, pwd category under out of these 18 vacancies are reserved for the pwd kiske liye kitna hai wo yahan pe mention kiya hua hai and then uh, this abbreviation whatever is being used in this particular thing now come to the education qualification and the experience required because when we talk about the senior that even e2 grade then the experience is required so for post of renewable energy then uh, pay scale is also mentioned upper age limit is mentioned and your bachelor degree should be in chemical electrical electronics power electronics instrumentation mechanical means roughly all the major branches are already uh, means are eligible to apply for this but you should have one year experience in this particular domain you can go through that similarly for this boiler operations branches like chemical mechanical electrical with 60% certificate proficiency as boiler operation engineer that is very important and this this uh, uh, experience is required so similarly for mechanical means roughly one year minimum experience is required if you have to apply for this particular post for all the branches one year experience is required for major, for all the branches for this uh, uh, cnp for this fire and safety for civil one year experience required now let us see what is for the finance and accounts for marketing yes again one year experience is required what is the requirement 65% and with uh, any bachelor degree in engineering bachelor degree in any uh, branch with two year mba with specialization in marketing oil and gas petroleum energy energy and infrastructure with one year experience in this particular domain so this is the combination basically they are looking for is for the marketing similarly for the finance and account ca cma or uh, bcom with this much of percentage and with two year mba with specialization in finance means uh, if you have bcom mba two year in finance 65% plus this experience also you are eligible right so these uh, criteria similarly also graduate in engineering that is b btech with two year mba specialization in finance also eligible with one year required experience so this is required similarly for hr also this is the qualification requirement you can go through that for law also this is the requirement uh, you should have the graduate degree in any discipline with 60% marks 
plus bachelor degree and bachelor degree in law llb with minimum 3 year of professional course with minimum 60% plus 1 year experience accordingly so read these qualification requirements and experience requirements very carefully right so next come to the relaxation and other things about the uh, selection criteria your cgp all these things are mentioned there b btech me mtech these uh, com uh, these uh, uh, combined modules are all combined qualifications are also eligible for that right so what is the requirement for individually just go through this document very carefully age relaxation for category wise this is mentioned over there otherwise minimum was 28 uh, respectively and your pay scale initial basic and then the fully pay scale will be this now next come to the very important part which is going to be your selection criteria because selection criteria ke liye bahut zyada doubts hote hain ki sir isme return hoga nahi hoga directly ye gd gt ke liye bulayenge kya criteria that is very important so this is the selection process see they have clearly mentioned the next process will be depending upon directly that how many candidates have applied for that it will totally depend upon that right otherwise the criteria is selection process will involve group discussion and or interview before the selection committee for all the post except the following for the following the criteria is something different otherwise group discussion and or see interview will be there interview will be there group discussion will be there or not interview will be uh, written will be there or not that depends upon the number of candidates who have been applied for that it is totally depending upon that what is the uh, if you if, we, if you ask us that what is the criteria see it is again depending upon what is their last year uh, uh, means uh, happened last year see it depends upon the how many number of candidates applied that also depending upon the number of vacancies so if the number of vacancies are high more people will apply if the number of vacancies are less comparatively less people apply for that less people interested for that then in that case directly gd interview or directly interview will be there otherwise uh, in case of your if the vacancies are more like in this uh, hr this finance this civil mechanical vacancies are huge then there are chances they may go for the one additional round also right so this is very important now come to the second stage which is the your how you have to prepare for the group discussion how you have to prepare for the interview you know that your pdi is india's largest platform which will prepare you that uh, for the gd and the interview part see about the group discussion it is all about practice definitely yes you must be aware about some of the topics related to the group discussion lekin ek cheez maan ke chalna ki jab bhi aap actual mein group discussion mein baithte hain there are more than 70 80% chances are there that you don't have any knowledge about the topic ye assume karke chalna assume karke chalna and prepare accordingly uh, and how you have to prepare this thing that if you don't have any idea about the group discussion topic then how you will be able to speak over that how you can conquer that this group discussion that can only be done by the practice just try to attend as much as mock sessions as possible otherwise yes relevant uh, this topics and will uh, this uh, with their explanation will also be provided now come to the interview part see whenever there is a interview for the experience post three most important components are there first one is your introduction very very important what were you doing from the Uh, when you have graduated or what is the minimum qualification requirement over there from there till today what are you doing from the last 3 years last 4 years last 5 years from last 2 years what are you doing very important thing so in the introduction you have to mention very interesting things over there such that ki jo next introduction khatam hone ke baad jo teen char questions hai wo wahi se aane chahiye this is very important so introduction is the most important part for any interview so what you have to speak over there what you do not to speak over there very very important second component is your hr part and secondly also that introduction also varies from person to person if somebody is having the experience of 5 years somebody is having the experience of 1 year introduction will be totally different secondly about the hr part about the hr part if you are already working this is experience post you are already working why you want to leave that you have already spent 4 year with this company why you want to leave that uh, uh, what negative you uh, had experienced in your last pre last company so many question why you want to leave that why gail why not any other organization why public sector how you find yourself as the best suitable candidate with, with uh, for, for this post so many questions they are going to ask you this is the hr part and the third part that is a technical domain see now it depends upon that how much experience you have if your experience is let us suppose one year only or near to one year one one and a half year then they are going to expect uh, they are going to ask the question from your job experience that will be there whenever there is experience post they ask you from your job experience but if your experience is one one and a half year then they can also expect very basic uh, understanding about the subjects with which that you were dealing jis bhi topic se aap deal kar rahe hain jis bhi domain mein aap work kar rahe hain uske related wo basic expect karta hai but agar aapka experience is let us for 3 year 5 years then your complete interview 
will go into your job experience part so for the job experience what they are going to ask you this is very important now again to prepare for all these things what they can expect what they are going to ask you how you have to judge that how you can know these things again by going for the mock sessions once you start going for the mock session then only automatically the question will come because somebody asked me so people ask me that uh, sir do you have the list of questions which were being asked last year yes we have the question which were being asked last year but the question varies person to person see this question is very common why you want to join gail why you want to leave your previous organization is there study in standard answer for that no answer varies from person to person similarly questions also varies from person to person और अगर मैं आपसे पूछूं कि क्या जब आप इंटरव्यू के लिए जाते हैं एक्चुअल में तो क्या उन्होंने सेट ऑफ क्वेश्चंस अपने पास रखे होते हैं जो उन्होंने पूछने हैं नहीं सिमिलरली जब आप कभी भी मौके के लिए जाएंगे तो क्या सेट ऑफ क्वेश्चंस मेंटर ने रखे होंगे अपने पास नहीं जब आपका इंट्रोडक्शन स्टार्ट होगा वहीं से तो यार सारा स्टोरी स्टार्ट होता है वहीं से तो क्वेश्चन जो फ्रेम होने ऑटोमेटिकली स्टार्ट होते हैं सो दिस कम्स बाय द एक्सपीरियंस सो द ओनली वे टू प्रिपेयर फॉर द इंटरव्यू इज बाई गोइंग फॉर द मॉक सेशन एज मच एज पॉसिबल वन और टू सेशन इज नॉट गोइंग टू सॉल्व द पर्पज you have to go for the multiple number of sessions because when you go for the multiple sessions with multiple mentors then only multiple variety of questions comes out automatically and then you will answer that you will stuck over with there aap jhoot bhi bologe bluff maroge aapko lagega mera sahi gaya maine convince kar diya maybe shayad usko they are very experienced person aisa nahi hota hai so in the end you get the feedback that feedback is the most important part for any mock sessions either gd either the interview there is a scope of improvement and that improvement may be in terms of your knowledge and that improvement may be in terms of your personality personality your communication and your uh, this uh, uh, this your how you have basically uh, speaking over there that is there communication ka matlab kabhi bhi language se nahi hota hai communication ka language nahi aur language barrier jo hai wo hat chuke hain overall objective jo is intro ka rehta hai uh, jo jo interviewer hote hain jo aapse puchte hain question the overall objective yahi hai are you a suitable candidate for this post क्या आपका जो जॉब एक्सपीरियंस है वो इस इस जॉब के लिए हेल्प कैसे करेगा डायरेक्टली इंडायरेक्ट डायरेक्टली सो ओवरऑल ऑब्जेक्टिव वो ये जानने का कोशिश करेगा कि क्या आप इस जॉब के लिए सूटेबल कैंडिडेट हैं वाई यू वॉन्ट टू ज्वाइन गेल एंड वाई यू आर इंटरेस्टेड फॉर दिस गेल ये सारी चीजें और पिछला जॉब आपने क्यों छोड़ना है ये तीन चार चीजें होती हैं जो आपसे वो बाई आस्किंग वेरियस डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन दे विल आस्क यू राइट तो इस तरीके से प्रिपेयर करो यू कैन ज्वाइन योर पी डी एफ फॉर एनी ऑफ दी मॉक सेशन फॉर गेल और फॉर एनी ऑफ दी पब्लिक सेक्टर यू कैन गो फॉर द मॉक सेशन ऑफ योर पी डी एफ इफ यू आर एनी क्वेरी दिस कॉन्टेक्ट नंबर इज माइंड यू कैन कॉल मी डायरेक्टली एंड यू कैन डिस्कस विद मी थैंक यू एंड ऑल द बेस्ट टू ऑल ऑफ यू